Imagine a giant aircraft, soaring above the clouds, not with pilots, but an army of drones ready to unleash. This isn't science fiction anymore. This is the Jiotian SSUAV, China's game-changing drone mothership. Unveiled in 2024 and aiming for its first flight in June 2025, the Jiotian is no ordinary drone. It's a flying fortress designed for high-altitude, long-range operations, packed with swarm warfare capabilities. If successful, it could rewrite the rules of air dominance. So, what exactly is it? How does it work? And could it really change the face of modern warfare? The Jiotian SSUAV stretches 25 meters wide, about the size of a regional jet, with a maximum takeoff weight of 16 tons. Six tons of that are pure payload, drones, munitions, and sensors. It can cruise at 50,000 feet, remain airborne for 36 hours, and cover over 7,000 kilometers in a single mission. But Jotian's true innovation lies beneath its wings, literally. It can deploy up to 100 smaller drones mid-flight, including loitering munitions, surveillance units, and electronic warfare assets. So why is Jotian a game-changer? Because it represents the next stage of force projection. A single Jotian can saturate enemy airspace with drone swarms, overwhelming air defenses through sheer volume. Think of it this way, the US has the RQ-4 for surveillance and the MQ-9 Reaper for strikes. Jotian combines both roles and adds a third, real-time swarm coordination. It doesn't just hunt, it commands an airborne hive. China has already built four prototypes in just 18 months. This pace suggests confidence and a fully domestic supply chain. It's fast, it's scalable, and it's ready to deploy near hot zones like Taiwan or the South China Sea. But not everyone's convinced. Critics call it a gigantic missile magnet. Despite flying high, Jotian is still vulnerable to long-range interceptors like THAAD, Patriot Pac-3, and Aegis SM-3 systems. There's also skepticism over the swarm claims. Coordinating 100 drones in contested airspace, where jamming and cyber attacks are active threats, is an enormous technical challenge. Is this China's real capability, or just psychological warfare aimed at rattling its rivals? The Jotian SSUAV may be the boldest expression yet of China's unmanned warfare doctrine. Whether it succeeds or fails, it's clear, the age of the drone mothership is here. And with it, a whole new era of air combat strategy. Is Jotian a revolutionary leap in drone warfare, or just a very expensive target? Tell us in the comments below, and don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more Battlefield Tech analysis.